Hey cruisers, what do you say we unbox our new set of binoculars? So these are the US Camel Compact 10x42 Military HD Professional Army Green binoculars. So why did we buy them? Well, we're going to Alaska and one of the absolute essentials, as you know, for Alaska is to have a really nice pair of binoculars. So ours were too small and we weren't happy with the magnification. They were kind of a cute little travel size, but we needed a few more features in our binoculars. So Mr. Cruise Tips TV got himself onto Amazon and bought these. And of course we will link to them in the description below for you if you'd like to check them out. All right, so let's check them out. I haven't actually seen them before. Uh, my husband has, he opened the box and he's checked them out, but this is my unboxing. Here we go, oh, there's something in there. That must be a little strap or something. Is that a strap? Huh? Okay. All right. Boy, they really are military green. Oh, they have a nice little, um, they have a nice case. It totally, you know what this case reminds me of? It feels like I'm like, it really feels military grade. It feels like something that would be like in my pack if I was in the army. Check this thing out. It's nice, it's really nice. All right, opening. All right, here we go. Ooh, I wanna be really careful. So we ordered another set. Whoa, those little lens caps are coming right off. We ordered another set of binoculars that were in a, like a slightly smaller price range, you guys, from Amazon, and they arrived broken and we had to send them back. So we spent a little bit more on this pair and decided to kind of up our game. So you wanna see how big they are? Let's take a peek. Alrighty, they are about six and a quarter inches high by, I guess depends on where you measure, by about, I'd say a little over four and a half inches wide, if that gives you a frame of reference. So um, it looks like they have caps on both ends. Let's remove both of those. It's kind of a hard thing to test, isn't it? <laughs> Let's just check out the other corner of my house really quickly. Do I have these the right way? Am I looking at them? The, uh, it really felt like I was looking at them backwards. Well, they really need some adjusting then because I was not seeing anything. That's probably because I'm trying to look at something 10 feet away. So I think we'll... <laughs> <laughs> to risk looking ridiculous for any longer because this is not working out. I'm going to take them outside later. This is kind of cool though. So um, what makes these special, you guys, a couple of different features. Number one, they're fog proof. And of course, when you're going somewhere like Alaska, where you're going from a warm stateroom to a cold deck, you probably want them to not fog too much. And we were having issues with that before. My husband said he also really liked these little lens cap cover thingies. I don't really know what they are, but he said that they were great. They are also wait for it, waterproof, which is awesome because these little bad boys are gonna be going with us rain or shine in our day pack everywhere we go. So one of the things we're gonna be doing in Alaska possibly is whale watching. And I've heard that taking a good set of binoculars is good for whale watching, but um, then again, I kind of feel like I want my camera <laughs> when that moment happens. So we'll sort of see what happens. Can you think of any other features that I've forgotten here? They're lightweight, I did forget about that. So they're only about 1.4 pounds. My notes here are saying that they're a magnesium alloy body, lightweight but durable. They are lightweight, I think 1.4 pounds. I wouldn't say these classify necessarily as travel size, you guys, but you know, they'll do the trick. If you want quality, you have to sacrifice something. So let's check out this little strap here, see how it works. You guys know I'm not the MacGyver in the family. I am not the tech person in the family. I'm rarely ever good with anything like this. I don't even know if I want to try, but it looks to me like this strap somehow goes through this little area on the side of the binocular here. Would you say that's accurate, honey? Close enough. Do you think that's how it goes? You guys, this is like real unboxing, real Sherry style, not good. That could not possibly be correct because it just came right out. I'll take care of that. Yeah, thank you. Husband is going to take care of that later because I really have no idea, but what do you guys think? Um, worth what, $60 at the time of purchase? Price can vary a little bit. You could... 65 and then okay. the original ones about 40. The original ones that arrived broke arrived broken that we sent back. Okay, so what do you guys think about these? Does anyone own them? If you do, let us know. Leave some notes in the comments below. Be sure to follow us on our other channel, Cruise Tips TV, because we are heading north to Alaska. And we're going to be vlogging and taking these little bad boys along. I'm sure you'll see them in our vlogs. And we can't wait to show you all kinds of other gear that we have. So thanks so much for watching. Follow us on social media as well, Cruise Tips TV. Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Until next time, get in gear and get cruising. Bye. First mate of the week.
Ooh. Ooh, our dining room table looks fancy.